One of the questions I'm most frequently asked about friendly plastic is what's the best way to heat it to soften it? Now friendly plastic softens between 60 and 70 degrees centigrade, that's 140 to 155 degrees Fahrenheit. If it doesn't reach that temperature then it doesn't soften and if it becomes hotter than that it becomes very difficult to work with. So that's the most critical thing is getting the temperature right. And there's two ways of doing that. There's dry heat and wet heat. Wet heat obviously involves water, hot water, between 60 and 70 degrees centigrade and uh, that's 140 to 155 degrees Fahrenheit. Now to test whether the water is at the right temperature you can use a thermometer or if you use your finger, you, if you can dip your finger in just for no more than a second then that's about the right temperature. The thing you want to avoid is seeing any bubbles rising to the surface or any um, activity that makes it look like it's getting near simmering or boiling. Now, the things I use for um, heating up the water are these little electric crock pots. I've actually got a big one as well. You can also improvise with a pan on top of your single electric ring or indeed on top of your hob. Applications for the wet heat method. Bead making. These beads are made using uh, rolling bits of plastic in the hot water and you can use a bead roller to form the shapes but these ones I think I made just in my hands. Anything that you need to free form then that's when you need to use the hot water. So for instance this little Lizzie doll is hot water technique. This pendant is made from scraps and you could only do this using hot water, you couldn't possibly do that using dry heat. Friendly plastic pellets moulded into this little silicon mould and using hot water, I soften the plastic in hot water. And if you want to uh, stamp into something repeatedly, like this little box, the textured surface here has been stamped into repeatedly um, without using, using inks, that's the hot water method too. Now, on occasions I need to use both hot water and the heat gun and that in particular is when I'm working on my lacework technique. So the base layer is with a heat gun and the subsequent layers are all hot water. I hope that's explained a few things for you about the heating methods of friendly plastic. Just remember whatever heating method you use, use it safely and make sure the temperature doesn't reach beyond 60 to 70 degrees centigrade, 140 to 155 degrees Fahrenheit.